Hey, Danny. Let's read Nuffle Bunny, a cautionary tale by Mo Willems. We were lucky. This one was actually signed by Mo Willems for us. Not so long ago, before she could even speak words, Trixie went on an errand with her daddy. Trixie and her daddy went down the block, through the park, past the school, and into the laundromat. <laughs> Trixie helped her daddy put the laundry into the machine. We've got lots of tears in this book. It's beloved. She even got to put the money into the machine. Oh, 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 what's that? And then they left. But a block or so later, Trixie realized something. <laughs> Trixie turned to her daddy and said, Aggle, flaggle, clabble. That's right, replied her daddy. We're going home. Aggle, flaggle, clabble, said Trixie again. Blaggle, plabble, whoppy, flappy, snurp. Now, please don't get fussy, said her daddy. Well, she had no choice. Trixie bawled. Wah! <laughs> she went boneless. She did everything she could to show how unhappy she was. By the time they got home, her daddy was unhappy too. As soon as Trixie's mommy opened the door, she asked, Where's Nuffle Bunny? That's what I've been trying to say. The whole family ran down the block and they ran through the park. They zoomed past the school and into the laundromat. I know Dan's ripped. Trixie's daddy looked for Nuffle Bunny and looked and looked and looked. But Nuffle Bunny was nowhere to be found. So Trixie's daddy decided to look harder until Nuffle Bunny! <laughs> and those were the first words Trixie ever said. This book is dedicated to the real Trixie and her mommy. Oh, no. The end. Do you like that book? Mm-hmm.